The track is ready at Lee Hedges Stadium for the Gulf Coast Athletic Conference 2023 Track and Field Championship hosted by the Shreveport Bossier Sports Commission. The meet is expected to generate a large revenue over the course of two days. Having the opportunity to be able to come home um, and to have these student athletes experience just a, a top-notch quality meet um, in a place like Shreveport, I think means the world. Dr. Kiki Borns is no stranger to Shreveport. As a Menden, Louisiana native, Lee Hedges Stadium is in fact her old running grounds. Barnes was announced as the GCAC commissioner in 2022, making her the first African-American woman to lead the GCAC and the only African-American woman commissioner in the NAIA. I think that's a message to others when you're trying to find your purpose. Just do good work um, and every now and then, you, I mean, hey, you may, you may make history, you may break some records and even be considered a trailblazer. Wiley College, located right here in the Arklatex in Marshall, Texas, is ready for their inaugural year in the GCAC. But I think we are looking forward to it is just being able to go out there and compete. Um, just go out there and compete. I think the kids are excited about it. Um, just going out competing. But at the same time, just um, letting Shreveport know what's in their backyard. Uh, you know, a lot, of, a lot of students in Shreveport don't know nothing about Wiley College. The competition at this weekend's meet is expected to be on a high level with Dillard being the reigning champs and Wiley College being a national ranked team. You're going to get some really great competition. We have some really good programs. Um, Dilla University was the champion from last year. Wiley is in their first year as a member of the Gulf Coast Athletic Conference, and they have had a nationally ranked program for a long time. So seeing those two pro programs go at it, that's going to be fun. Also this weekend, the GCAC will have its first HBCU admission sphere at the championship to also engage the community and inform students of other GCAC. AC opportunities. In Shreveport, Tamar Knight, KSLA News 12.